Computer Adaptive Testing, or CAT, uses today's technology to customize test questions to your knowledge level. Let's take a brief look at how CAT works using a fitness example. The goal of CAT is to find out if a candidate can reach the passing standard of the exam, just as you can use a treadmill to measure how fast you can run. A person could walk, jog, run, or sprint on a treadmill. At each level, the speed will increase. If you can jog, we already know you can walk. To determine your speed, you might be asked to jog and then run. Or you might be asked to sprint. If you cannot sprint, the speed will slow to a running pace. If you cannot run, then the speed will slow to a jogging pace. Another way to see how computer adaptive testing works is by showing a candidate's progress through the MBLEX. As a candidate answers questions correctly or incorrectly, the computer adapts to his or her level of ability. Since the difficulty of the questions depends on which ones a candidate answers correctly, each candidate will have a different set of questions. Computer adaptive testing does not allow for candidates to flag questions for later review. A candidate will pass the MBLEX if he or she answers 100 questions and reaches a competence level at or above the passing standard. However, a candidate will not pass if his or her competence level is below the passing standard or if the candidate answers fewer than 100 questions during the time allowed. The MBLEX is an assessment of your ability to practice safely and competently. Passing the MBLEX shows that you are ready to take the next steps to become a newly licensed entry-level massage practitioner. Understanding how computer adaptive testing works will help you understand the testing experience. At fsmtb.org, you can find other materials to help you prepare for the MBLEX, 